Now to welcome back to the Harvey Norman Lounge on Pet Corner, emergency vet news and dog trainer Kelly McFarlane. Morning, Kelly. Good morning. Firstly, oh my goodness, who is this that you brought along today? This is the gorgeous Humphrey, who's a 13-week-old cavoodle. Gosh, he is the most chilled out dog I think I've ever met. Yeah, he's absolutely adorable. And you brought a lot of toys in as well. Yeah, brought heaps of toys here. Um, so we thought, as we've got the, the puppy, we'll just talk about some great toys for dogs to play with. Okay. Tell me about this one. This is an actual, it's called a safe stick. And uh, okay. so, instead of, yeah, so instead of chucking your sticks around off the, off the uh, trees, then instead you're going to use this one. Right, nice There's and bright. There's a variety of colours. Okay, what else have you got here? Uh, we've also got um, the frisbee which um, we know many dogs like. So again, for this one, um, yeah, really great toy. It's actually quite safe as well because usually we find a lot of Frisbees are quite hard yep. and therefore it can cause problems with the dog's What's with teeth. the holes? Um, just a good way to be able Aero to grab it. Mix. Yeah, just <laughs> chuck it, make it go nice and far. Um, and then, of course, we have uh, the lovely poor Henry's um, Humphreys, desperate, desperate to get all this lot. Uh, then we've got the loofah, um, little dog. So, again, um, nice and soft, and it actually kind of crackles and squeaks. Oh, look. I'm sorry, Humphrey. Humphrey's getting pretty excited yeah, by all this. Like, Hurry up. <laughs> There's a huge amount of stuff here. Tell me about this little guy in your lap. Um, so this is called a little muff pup and they come in all different sizes. Uh, so I thought I'd bring this along especially because it looks like Humphrey. It does. <laughs> Very much so. And Mike actually thought this was Humphrey. So. <laughs> <laughs> We've both got a little muff pup sitting <laughs> um, they come in a variety of sizes, so you can get a small size, which is this one, uh, for $10. You can get them in a medium size, which are 15 and then the large are $20. And usually you would normally pay for a large um, size, Muff Pup would be over $40. So why do you need to have toys for your animal, for your dog? Why is it so important? Well, with anything, it's, you know, especially with dogs or, or any animal, we know that they need enrichment mentally as well as physically. And so a variety of these toys are a great way for them, number one, to enjoy themselves, you know, when they are on their own, especially puppies wanting to chew. And that's why we have things like the Nyla Bones, which are really good. And, is it a uh, chew toy? It is, yes. Oh, yes, isn't that. it, Humphrey? Yeah, yeah. It is a chew toy. <laughs> Um, so, you know, that, that's one thing. Um, certainly for Humphrey, he's been outside the studio today. He was going crazy with this thing out there. So I think most of, oh, I think everyone um, here has literally got a little Instagram video of him playing with oh, it. Oh, I have. So. It's my story. Um, <laughs> should I give him his muff pup? You can give him his pup. Humphrey. I'm not sure how worn out he is now. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. He's ready for bed. <laughs> Oh, he is. This dog, honestly, he's stolen the hearts of every single person in the studio right now. So of all of these toys, what sort of thing is, are they suitable for different kinds of dogs? Yeah, I mean, certainly, you know, things like the, the safe sticks, the frisbees, they're great for dogs who love to play uh, recall and, and bring things back to you. Um, you know, certainly if you've got a dog that's a chewer, um, then you definitely want to go for kind of your tougher toys like the Kong, which is over there in the middle. And, you know, for some dogs, it's just all about playing with the, the tennis balls. So mm. pretty much it really depends on your dog what they really enjoy um, and then basically get get them the toys to match and you've got a great giveaway too from our friends at pet post what can people win all of this Whoa. and a new muff pup and a new muff pup you don't get humphrey's <laughs> you old don't get humphrey's one no <laughs> okay gosh that's a huge amount of toys it'll keep you stocked up for ages yep so they're doing a really good giveaway excellent good to see and how much is it worth uh three hundred dollars well, over $300, I should say. Yeah. Excellent. Hey, thank you so much, Kelly. Now, if you would like the chance to win this incredible prize worth $300 and a new clean muff pup too from Pet Post, simply go to our Facebook page to enter. And while you're there, why not enter your furry or feathered friend into our Pet of the Week competition for another chance to win, just like 10-week-old Luna, who's got $50 to spend at petpost.co.nz. And it's on to your owner, Darren Hodge, in the Rangi Order. Past Pet Post have a huge range of toys on sale until midnight Wednesday, some great toys too. So go check them out at petpost.co.nz. Humphrey is all worn out. <laughs> Can you come home with me?